What's up guys, I'm Phoenix Master one and welcome back for some more Fire Mom Heroes and today I'm gonna be summoning on this year's Halloween banner and as always with a new banner comes a new giveaway so I'm giving away a $25 Google Play or an iTunes gift card which roughly amounts to 40-45 ARBs depending on which ARB package you buy or where you live and which currency you have and this is a region free giveaway so anyone can enter so if you're interested check the link in the description and I also want to congratulate the winner of my previous giveaway which I did for the legendary Tiki banner so let's begin with this uh, banner and I'm really hoping to get uh, Mia and of course Kagero as well all of these units are uh, pretty powerful on this banner <laughs> three of them are armor units and Mia is a really unique unit uh, being the first flying healer okay let's go with the blue stone the good thing about this banner is that no one shares a focus color with anyone um, so you can summon on all of the colors and be safe with that so I'm gonna get Christmas Cavaliers it looks like okay I see that smoke this could be Niles it is Silas four star Silas okay yeah Silas has been demoted to four star 80 um, I haven't really seen any kind of post or anything like that uh, about this banner with 4-star Silas. He does have steady stands at 4-star rarity, of course, as a lot of people expected, and of course, reposition. If I do get um, a good IV Silas, I'm definitely going to be promoting him. Okay, three Cavaliers so far. Am I going to get Brave Veronica and Elise as well? <laughs> To complete my cavalier circle okay you're not cavalier you cannot ride a horse all right my luck with the last year's halloween banner was decent um i was not able to get halloween henry for the longest time i remember um let's see how my luck goes for this banner okay i'm gonna get leon ignis and guard is really nice i really wish they would demote some of these skills on these units Leon should have guard 3. Like, it's not really as good of a skill to log that at 5 star. Like, the full version. Okay. I got uh, 4 star units all across the board. Uh, let's try to get Mia. If I get uh, a good IV Kagero, I'll probably give her a close counter, to be honest. Her stat spread is amazing for a close counter build. I would probably just give her um, Barb Shuriken or Rogue Dagger. She's got absurd attack for a dagger unit, highest so far, uh, with 38 base attack, which is absolutely insane. Man, she can run all of those uh, Festival and Oshido daggers really well, which do effective damage. And Merce's stat line is also min-maxed as hell. Um, <laughs> insane defense. But I do not think she has dethroned uh, Zelgius. Sure, Mer can have better stat line than Zelgius. Um... And have much better min max stat line, but in my opinion, Zelgius is still really nice. And I would definitely prefer Zelgius over Mur um, because of Black Luna. Zelgius can definitely use uh, Black Luna with uh, something like Sling Edge and Special Spiral. And he does have good enough speed to run that safely. Not to mention, he can also run the instant uh, Black Luna build. Okay, I'm gonna get Minerva. Yeah, you can also run the instant Black Luna build with Cook and Pulse Steady Breath. Um, and Mer does not really have anything like Black Luna. <laughs> okay, so let's check the IVs of this Minerva. Um, level 1. She is plus speed minus defense, I think. Yeah, she's plus speed minus defense. Okay, um, plus speed is really nice, I guess, with her weapon refine. I used to use Minerva quite a lot, but then I guess I just stopped using any sort of Axe Flyer. I actually really want Har and Jill in the game as well. Um, we are getting some Tellius alts from every now and then, like Mia, Elencia, and Mikaya. I would definitely like um, Christmas Ike. I want to see him having some fun for once, and maybe even Christmas Soren. That would be nice, but... Uh, an actual Tellius banner would be really nice, actually, with Har and Jill. Those are the two units I really want out of Tellius. And I guess Sephirin, um, a Grand Hero Battle Staff unit, would be really nice. Uh, this is a really great chance of getting Mia from this. So I'm going to keep talking about Tellius then. Maybe Mia will show up. Um, so my dream is getting... Okay, I'm going to get uh, Legault. Yeah, 
So my dream is getting a uh, Fire Sweep Axe, Jill in the game, and she has a stat line similar to that of Summer Innes, but she's gonna be present in the permanent pool, and she gets demoted then, and we will have a really nice offensive Axe Flyer in the pool, which we don't really have, um, and uh, Fire Sweep Axe at 4 star would be absolutely nice. And in best case scenario, they give her Hone Flyers and then demote her to 4 star, that would be just too good. This is another level of wishful thinking, I think. Um, okay, so let's check IVs of this Felicia. Uh, resistance, minus defense. Yeah, I saw that one. She was definitely appearing to be minus defense. Plus resistance, I guess it's nice for uh, ploys, but it's really an overkill, honestly, with her stat spread. Okay, come on. Show up, please, Mia. It's gonna be Kaze. Yeah, the colorless pool has definitely become better now. Um, got Legault and Kaze in the same batch. Two of the most amazing, um, two of the most amazing colorless units. Okay. Kagero, can you please show up? Kagero is honestly so disappointed in her voice lines for this Halloween alt. Um, <laughs> it's kind of funny. I do like Kagero, um, but it was really weird how she got a Halloween alt. I think they should do more with the Halloween costumes. They're not really spooky enough. Um, in my opinion, Niles has got the best Halloween costume so far. Um, and they could definitely use some makeup, I guess. Like, Kagero should have a really uh, pale white face with maybe blood coming out. Okay, that would be too much. Uh, but maybe some kind of mascara spoiled up a bit. She looks spooky. In this maid outfit, she doesn't really look spooky. Come on. Niles as a devil costume is pretty nice. Um, Mars is also decent, but then I saw her dragon. And she's got the same dragon model as her normal version. I would have really liked some kind of black and red dragon form uh, for her model. That would definitely be really nice. Um, but they just left her model as it is. Okay, I'm gonna get Chrom. Ether, there we go. Wow, Odin and Uncle Chrom in the same batch. And also Robin. Wow, okay. One colorless stone. Come on, Mia, please show up. Niles is absurdly fast at 39 base speed. It's He's honestly insanely fast. Okay, I'm gonna get Lissa. <laughs> I got the whole Awakening family. Robin, Krom, Odin, Lissa. Okay, let's go with the green stone. Please don't give me Frederick to complete that Awakening family. Give me Kagero. Okay, it's gonna be Bowie. Alright. Um, come on, Niles. If I do get multiple Niles, I'll probably give um, Attack Speed Link to my Legendary Lucina because I really enjoy using Legendary Lucina with her future vision. It's so unique and so fun. At least in the in-game modes, like, she gets the job done real quick, and with attack speed length, she's gonna be insane. But Niles... Okay, I'm gonna get Hinoka. Wow. 5-star Hinoka, and I also got 5-star Minerva. Pretty random 5-star units. Okay, so let's check her IVs. Uh, she is right here. Warrior Princess, yeah. Okay, so this is a completely neutral Hinoka. Completely neutral. Um, I'm probably just gonna be using her for Hone Flyers, I guess. Because it is definitely rare. Okay, so I guess I'm just gonna be using her for fodder. Um, that Minerva, I'm probably just gonna merge her. Because Life and Death is available on Soth. Hopefully I can summon some Soth because I haven't really summoned one of them in a while. And I also want to get good IVs for him, so that I can upgrade him. Okay, so... I'm gonna get Sully now. Back to 3% we go. Um, almost 100 orbs and 2 5-star units, which is actually pretty decent. The average is usually um, more than 100 orbs for a 5-star unit. And for a 4-unit banner, it's even um, higher. Right. They should honestly just give us a pain plus healer as a free-to-play unit. 
in the Three Heroes quest. They could even run like Tempest Trial uh, units in the Three Heroes quest as a way of increasing their merge count. So Lei has got Blazing Wind, uh, which is definitely an amazing AoE special. A lot of people do consider it the best AoE special. Alright, got Gunter once again. I do get plenty of Gunters for some reason. Um, come on, Niles, come on. It's gonna be Sully once again. I just got you in the last patch. Odin's Refine has got Attack Speed Link and Niles has got Attack Speed Link for this Halloween alt. And both of them are Leo's retainers. And it's a bit ironical how Leo in Fire Room Heroes sucks in both of those stats in Attack and Speed Department like the normal Leo. Even the Summer Leo version isn't really the greatest, um, but still. He does have resistance, I guess can be used for plies. Uh, that's what I use my Summer Leo for Arena Assault. Okay, so I'm gonna get Sophia. Mur is definitely an insane red armor. Um, we didn't really get any kind of insane red armor for a really long time. We just had Zelgius and Winter Tharja. Uh, which were like more than six months ago. And now Mur is just going to be joining their ranks. Who's going to be the colorless armor dragon? They have released all kinds of uh, armor dragons. We are just left with colorless. For some reason, I got two Sophias. Um, come on. Oh, wow. Shauna. There we go. Pretty nice. I also need some Hinata. <laughs> you guys should definitely use Fury units because we only have like one more day for that uh, for that competition, which will give us like free four-star Hinata if we deploy Fury units 10 million times. I do not even remember the name of the event. Um, okay, one colorless stone. This might be Mia. Mia has got memed on quite hard uh, because of her voice clip. <laughs> her voice is pretty memeable, but honestly, I do not really find it annoying. It has honestly grown on me. And if you have played Path of Radiance and uh, Radiant Dawn, then the voice acting is absolutely amazing. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna get stall. Uh, getting a lot of Christmas Cavaliers, it seems like. There are so many Tellius units, honestly, um, which are really popular. And it seems like they have been starting to give the alts to them in recent times. Even actually, yeah, Sanaki even got um, an alt for the uh, Bridal Blessing banner. But she was from Path of Radiance, not from Radiant Dawn. Okay, you're just going home. You do realize that. Okay. 3.75. No focus units so far. Um, I've still not completed the Paralog and uh, the Squad Assault and the quest from that. I could get the orbs from there um, in case I need those. No focus units so far. Kagero, can you please show up? Can you please cooperate and show up as the first focus unit? I would really appreciate that. It's gonna be Frederick. Um, let's go with the redstone. Let's hope for Mur. Her voice lines are amazing uh, for this Halloween alt. I'm gonna get lean. Okay, she's my merch project, so it's fine. You can pity break me. No problem about that because you have done that plenty of times before when I was trying to get Ares. Uh, speaking of Ares, Mia's staff is a. Uh, pretty bad for Ares users because it just cancels out his uh, Dark Missile Tin effect and I guess Special Spiral. Um, so let's check our IVs. I've not really got um, a pretty good IV lean so far. I've got like plus 8 lean so far. I just need one more lean I guess to plus 10 merger. Um, okay, so this is plus defense minus resistance. The best one I've got so far is like plus resistance minus HP. So I'm just gonna be merging her. She does have, uh, <laughs> she does have a support with Ares. 
She's not even a demoted unit, but she showed up so many times that I just decided to merge her, I guess. Didn't really use her safeguard for anyone. Okay, so Lena has broken my pity rate. Uh, back to three we go. Um, come on, Niles, can you show up? At least one focus unit. Um, that's gonna be Karin. I'm honestly surprised they haven't really given Karin a legendary alt, seeing as how popular he or she is. Probably female Karin is gonna get the alt. Uh, let's be honest. <laughs> Probably some kind of dragon form. Okay. Gwendolyn. Um, Mer is the only real whale bait on this banner because I don't think a lot of whales will try to plus and merge Kagiru or Niles because they don't really have the highest BST and whenever the dual skills come out for that kind of uh, units, like those units with the dual skills will be able to outscore them. Now granted, uh, Kagiru and Niles are definitely much more powerful than those dual units. But for plus and merging and for being a cheerleader, those units might excel in that regard. For example, Soren. Um, Soren can score higher than Halloween Henry with the green infantry dual skill. And he can also be a better cheerleader with the double chill skills that you can run on him. With the chill attack and the other chill skills and ploys you could run on him. This is not the Niles I'm looking for, but okay. Maybe this is a sign. Come on, Mia, please show up. Not another Niles. Okay, it's gonna be Jacob. Oh my god. Um, four, four star units and one three star of Gwendolyn. Okay, this might be it. This might be Mia and Kagero and Mer in the best case scenario. Okay, Klein. Deathblow is always welcomed. Um, also has quicker post and brave bow. Excellent fodder unit. It's gonna be Frederick. Good thing I've not got Botray so far. And now that I've said that, he's probably gonna show up. Maybe Mia is hanging out in this stone. Maybe. Nope. This is Kaze. Okay, pretty amazing unit so far. Uh, Klein and Kaze. If you're not gonna be giving me Mia, please just give me Soth. That would be really, really nice. It's gonna be Warrior uh, Princess Hinoka, or I guess Kinchi Knight Hinoka. Two Hinokas in the same summoning session. What's up with this? Um, so many non-focus units on this banner, but honestly, I didn't even have a pity rate, um, so I'm fine with that. Blue Sky Warrior, um, plus attack, yes, plus attack, minus defense. Oh, minus defense definitely hurts her quite a lot if you're trying to take hits from, uh, distant counter units, but definitely gonna be building her up. Plus attack, minus defense is honestly really, really nice, um... Yeah, it's pretty nice. She's gonna be having 13 defense. <laughs> Probably just might give her wind sweep. <laughs> to be honest. But plus attack is nice. Her model, or I guess sprite, is so big compared to these other units. The wings flapping. Um Mer. Can you show up? Okay, I'm gonna get Sylvia. Four star Sylvia. Um I'm looking for a good IV Sylvia. Um that I can promote. So got Inoka, pretty good. I've got a good amount of 5-star units actually. <laughs> Just none of them are focus units, so that's the catch. But this can change. This is the perfect batch, it has got all of the stone colors. Okay, Azama. You're not Mia. You're not Waluigi. Okay. Niles? Come on, man. I need that speed of yours. He can run Special Fighter really well, but the thing is that he's not really all that bulky. Even his HP is not really all that high, it's just like one point higher than Halloween Henry. Who has got, who has got like the lowest HP out of any kind of armor in it. Okay, 
It's definitely gonna be uh, throwing me off a couple of times if I get Kagero and if I use her um, <laughs> with her sprite because that's what happened with Valentine Lin. She looks like an infantry unit and it used to throw me off so many times like when I started to use her. I got Selena, pretty nice. Uh, give me Hinata now. Yeah, I'd say 3 star. Hinata would be perfect. Okay, I'm gonna get Tharja. Fine. 3.25. Uh, 191 orbs to go. I could just get extremely lucky and uh, get all of the focus units because it's uh, all about RNG. I've got some pretty good 5 star units so far and plus attack. Hinoka is definitely really nice. Even plus speed Minerva is not really all that bad. And Lean, of course, for the merge project. She would be like my first plus 10 dancer. Um, okay, Sarah. Yeah, I use her music quite a lot. It's natural she's gonna show up. Come on, Kagero, can you please show up? Anyone? Okay, it's gonna be Nino who shows up. Um, now three units have got reposition and three units have got drawback. So that's nice distribution. One focus unit, Niles, please. Okay, another drawback unit. Mer. Come on, can you show up? I do have uh, two Ephraims. The normal version and the legendary version. He's your brother. Come on, Mer, please show up. Um, Mer does not have any kind of line for uh, Ephraim, I guess. Referring to Ephraim. Um, three colorless stones. Okay, I'm just gonna get uh, Sakura. Yeah, I'm also looking for a good IV Sakura that I can upgrade. Obviously, I cannot put every unit on the um, layout. I've never really got a good IV Sakura so far. I got good amount of clients from this banner. This might be Kagiro, this might be Niles, and this might be Mia. Come on. Please let that happen. <laughs> yeah, that can happen. There's the smoke. So at least <laughs> my hope didn't just fail. But it's gonna be Cecilia. Not the green unit I'm looking for. Kagiro is extremely bulky. She has such min max stats. Okay, I'm gonna get Felicia. You're not an armor unit for some reason. You're wearing the same outfit as Kagiro. What's up with that? This is not really a plus attack Felicia. Okay, this blue stone. I just need one focus unit to get that ball rolling. Uh, Jagan. Okay. What's my pity rate? 3.75. I think this is the highest I went on this banner. And then just I would just get like a 5 star unit. So many blue stones. I might get a lot of Shanas and maybe one Niles here and there. Yeah, Lucas has nothing for skill intense. He just has obstruct 3. Um, that's pretty much it. Not even Fortress Defense 3. Honestly, they should just demote some unit with Fortress Res uh, to 4 star. <laughs> I would definitely like that. It would definitely increase the ability of plowing for a lot of units. Okay, I'm gonna get Oscar. You can actually run Fortress Defense on Mer as a budget option, honestly, because it is active in both phases and it also helps with her Spirit Breath activation condition. While also giving you the defense in the enemy phase. And she's got plenty of attack, honestly. Okay, Mur, I'm talking about you. Can you please show up? We don't have candies, but we do have your brother, Ephraim. Um, so that might be an incentive. Okay, there's the smoke. This could be it. <laughs> You're not Mur. Alright, so we are at 4 uh, PD rate now. No focus units so far. Why is this reminding me of the uh, 
of the <laughs> arrival of the brave banner but at least uh, I got a lot more focus units on this banner compared to the uh, choose your legends 2 banner there I just got like three five star units and 450 orbs here it is better and I also got some good units okay so I'm just gonna get Camilla Maybe Kagira will follow up because they both have really nice personalities, so maybe they will just show up in the same batch. Okay, never mind. Don't be bot trip, please. Okay, Bowie is fine. Mia, please, can you show up? Come on, man. Nope. This is gonna be Satsuna. Uh, Niles, maybe? Since we are in the Fates games, I guess, with Satsuna and Camilla. Nope. This is gonna be Noe. Alright. Mia. Please. Show some mercy. Okay, it's Alyssa. Uh, not the worst one. She does have Renewal too at 4 star. And also Gravity, of course. Okay, another perfect batch with all of these stone colors. If only I can get the focus units, it would be truly perfect with this batch. Uh, another Niles. <sighs> okay. Why are you teasing me with this Niles and not giving me the blue Niles? Okay, this might be the actual one. Nope. This is Effie. Um, Kagiro, maybe? We are pretty much in Fate's Realm, I guess, with uh, Effie, Niles, and from the previous batch as well. It's gonna be Hawkeye. This man got par crept into oblivion. Come on. Okay. We got Libra right after Hawkeye. Wow. Mur, come on, please. Uh, yeah, there's the smoke. This could be it. I'm hoping. At least one focus unit. Alright, uh, our pity rate is probably at 4.25 here. Really hoping to get all of the focus units uh, in these 90 orbs. Uh, that would be really nice. I'm still hoping for Mia here, or even Soth. I've not got one Soth so far. This is definitely very sad. I did get one Legal, so that's something. And also two Kazes, if I remember correctly. Nana would also be nice with drive defense, to be honest. Okay, this is gonna be a three star. Lucius once again. Um Niles. His name is something like Halloween Tease or something like that for his alt. And he's truly living up to his name. I got like three normal Niles. I usually do not summon Niles all that much. But now I want to summon that Niles on the focus banner. Okay. We got Perry. Right. 4.75. Which Sonia would have been really nice actually as a Halloween unit uh, because in her ending in Echoes it pretty much says that she went to the Nui Baba's abode and a lot of people saw her <laughs> and mistook her as a witch, as a new witch and spread rumors about her. I'm pretty sure she has not become witch. She was probably just researching on how to uh, do stuff with her family. Um, <laughs> I'm not gonna spoil but she got mistook as a witch. So maybe on Halloween, she just goes out um, at becoming a witch to scare people. Okay, Clarine, Maria, Gunter, Hinata, please. That would be nice. Yeah, this could be Hinata. Nope, it's Pala. Okay, only 50 orbs to go. No focus units so far. This is pretty crazy. 
Um, but this is not the first time uh, this has happened. Okay. I'm gonna get chewed up. Please be plus attack minus HP, please. Okay, so this is not a plus attack Shida. She is uh, plus speed, but minus resistance. Okay. Five. Wow, we are at five. This is the new Hero Fest banner. Okay, three green stones. This might be it. Um, this might be it. I could get like three Kagiros, which would be insane, but it's honestly too good to be true. I'm hoping for that. Okay. Oh my god, please. For a second, I thought I got a five star Libra. I do want a plus speed minus HP Libra, so hopefully one of them is that. I did get a, um, I did get another Libra in my previous batches. I'm gonna get Kagero. Yes, finally one focus Tina. There we go. We did it. Now maybe I can get the other focus units. Okay, this is looking like plus attack uh, Kagero to me. I'm pretty sure this is plus attack Kagero. Uh, nope, this is neutral attack. She already has really high attack, so that's why I guess. Plus defense, that's perfect. That's perfect for the close counter build. Um, plus defense, minus resistance. Honestly, that's fine. Uh, not really all that bad. Yeah, 30 resistance is still pretty nice. I'm probably just gonna give her the Barb Shuriken, I guess, because she can just run Ignis with this. Um, yeah, she's gonna be having 35 defense, and if I uh, refine the Barb Shuriken for more defense, then that would be really nice. This is just a guard dagger. Not really the greatest, I guess. It could be good for defensive purpose, but... I mean, I'm, I can probably just replace that with Barb Shuriken. Uh, she does have Bolt Fighter, which you can fodder her off for, and also even Attack Wave, so... That's amazing. I finally got Kagero. Wow. I just wish they did more to her outfit uh, for the Halloween. Okay. Another Kagero? Come on. Okay. <laughs> Vatre. Probably it. Okay. Titania. Much better. I could get Niles from here. Uh, my PD rate is extremely high, so I do want to. Um, I do want to try and see if I can get any more 5 star units. Okay, I'm gonna get Reinhardt. Please be plus attack minus speed, the one I'm looking for. Yes, this is plus attack minus speed Reinhardt. I finally did it. I finally got the Ivy for Reinhardt, which I've been looking for 1.5 years. Yes, definitely gonna be building him up. I got pretty good Ivy Kagiro and amazing Ivy Reinhardt. Perfect IVs. Absolutely amazing. Finally got this Reinhardt, which I was looking for. Okay, now just give me Niles and I would be extremely happy from this patch. Um, yeah, it could be Niles. I saw the smoke. This could be it. Ah, oh my god. It's Perry. Why? Could you just not let Niles show up? So I got uh, plus attack, minus speed, Reinhardt, and Kagero. With pretty good IVs. Plus defense, minus resistance is nice. Okay, three appearance rate. Uh, not gonna be summoning on the green stones now. Just gonna be sniping red, colorless, and uh, blue, I guess. Uh, okay, just gonna get last low. I've, I've been summoning like full of circles till now. Okay, I'm gonna get Seth. I was really hoping for Mur. Nope. It's Virian. Um Nope. Another Virian. Go back to Rosane. Oh wait, you don't have Rosane. You got kicked out by Walhart. He conquered your Rosane. Too bad. I cannot even send you home now. Because you have none. You even got kicked out of the Aska Trio. Okay. As I <laughs> as I'm bullying Virian, I summon Mia. There we go. Mia also hates Virian, probably. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just joking about Virian. Okay. I got Mia, finally. Um, speed, are, speed is her biggest asset. Any IV Mia will honestly work for me. I don't really care about her IVs, honestly. Um, okay. Neutral attack, neutral speed. That's fine. Completely neutral, Mia. Wow, that's fantastic. Um, she does have Witchy Wand, uh, which does have... An insane description. And uh, she also has speed rest bond. 
Probably not all that good for skeletons. But it could be nice with the darting uh, stand sacred seal, which we're gonna be getting uh, this month. So I got Mia. <laughs> That's amazing. Okay, two focus units down. I just need to get Niles and Mur. Just need to get them. Okay. Let's see. Um <laughs> Oh my god. I'm going to get three bl three blue stones and one red stone. I should have known better, honestly. I should have known better. Um I'm going to try to get Mur. Nope. I'm not going to get that. Niles? Uh which one of these is Niles? This one? Probably? Okay, it's not gonna be Niles. I'm probably gonna go ahead and purchase some orbs because uh, I do want to get these two focus units. Alright, so I'm back and I did buy some orbs and for those of you who are new or just curious, any money I spend on this game is from uh, YouTube and it's my own and YouTube is pretty much my job. It's how I pay my college and support my parents um, and you guys seem to enjoy these summoning sessions quite a lot. And I really enjoy making these as well because I can talk freely. I do not have to read a script like my other reviews. I do not have to keep any sort of bullet points in mind. Um, so I really enjoy the freedom and these are pretty chill. And I can just uh, share my thoughts in these summoning sessions. Okay, so let's see if I can get Niles. As I said before, I do have uh, those uh, paralog maps and also the quest, which I've not really done. Um, so I could get orbs from there if I do not get Niles and Mur. Um, really hoping for Niles here. Come on. I did get two focus units in Kagero and Mia. Okay. I'm gonna get Lucas. Never mind. Both of those were actually really good IVs. Plus defense is just perfect with the, um, with the build I was trying to go for Kagero. And I could just run Barb Shuriken and run Ignis on her and she would just annihilate a lot of things. We have so many, like, good green armor units to choose from. <laughs> like, a lot of them. Too many of them. Okay. Um. Niles. Come on, man. Show up for Lord Leo. Never mind. Subaki's gonna show up for Sakura, I guess. Okay, first Subaki. Uh, why did I go for the colorless stone? Oh my god. Okay, that was a misclick. I meant to click on the red stone, and for some reason I went for the uh, colorless stone. I'm done with the colorless stones. Um, okay, fear. Okay, 49 orbs to go. I could get Niles and Mer from here if I do get lucky. Okay, pretty good so far. I'm getting the stone colors at least. Athena. Okay. Even something like Sturdy Blow, I guess, would be decent on, uh, on Mur. And Attack Defense Bond would also be really, really nice, actually, on her. Okay, I'm gonna get May. Um, 36 Arbs. Uh, what's my PD rate? 3.50. Okay, it's decent enough. Uh, wow, this is absolutely amazing, Batch. Absolutely amazing. Okay, we get Henry. Um, actually, I didn't see. Was the original Halloween banner rerun? I don't think I saw it. Okay, I'm gonna get Marth. They would have probably done that, because the Tempest Trial does begin from 14. And they do have the Halloween uh, units from both years. Actually, they will probably rerun Halloween Banner for the Tempest Trial Banner. Not now. Um, but in a few days, we will definitely have that. Okay, so 19 orbs to go. Um, and before, this gives me like a full batch. Okay, never mind. I could just go for these stones and then just try to get the orbs from the Paralog maps and the quests. Okay, so I'm gonna get Ellie Wood. Um... Come on. Mur, don't be scared. Just because Elliewood has been summoned, he's not gonna slay you <laughs> with this Durandal. Um, okay. Niles, come on. 
We have reached uh, Nora, it seems like, with Laszlo getting summoned. We have reached uh, Nora many times, but never got Niles. Got Abel. Okay. I'll be right back. I'll just get the orbs from the quests and the paralogue maps. Alright, so I did complete the paralogue quests and the chapters. Uh, let's go with this final batch for the summoning session video. Um, okay. I'm just gonna get a blue stone. That's it. No red stone for Mer. Um, if I get Cloth Summon Niles, I would be happy with that too. But this banner does last for a month. Okay, I'm gonna get Jagan. For a second, I thought it was Niles because, uh... He also has a bow, uh, which does kind of look like that silhouette. Okay, so I'm gonna get this fantastic uh, badge, and the regret is gonna be with me. Um, <laughs> let's hope that Mur is in one of these uh, stones. Or Niles? I'm gonna go with Mur. Come on. This is gonna be stall. Okay, um, this banner does last for a whole month. So that's a lot of time and uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did then please be sure to leave a like and uh, if you haven't already then make sure to subscribe for more Fire Emblem Heroes content. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.